Good afternoon. Welcome to our uh, US market update. Uh, stocks firming uh, today after a, a very weak uh, period last week. Uh, five straight days of down days for the, uh, the S&P, but it's back up today, doing a bit firmer. Um, you can see um, on the hourly chart how we're floating around this kind of region around 44.80. I just trade, traded up towards 45.50 uh, as recently as September 7th, but it's just peeled up off there. So you can see now where we're, where we're at. We're in this uh, steady downtrend, although, as I say, they are higher on the cash equity open. Um, looking at the futures, well, you're going to be looking at potentially uh, a bit of a down shift for the market. Um, and I think on a... Um, on this basis, if we were to draw this line out here, we can get a pretty nice, um, pretty nice trend support coming in there. Um, and we are we are looking to see whether or not that gets tested. So I wouldn't be surprised, although they're up this morning in the US, uh, if you do not see this area down here tested. Um, and it's a question of whether or not the market starts to roll over a bit more now that. Um, inflationary pressures and tapering and so on starts to become a bit more uh, important as we head into the back end of the year and uh, growth maybe starts to slow so i think you know the market which has been conditioned by the dip might no might uh, decide that that's no longer the best play if inflation is really starting to eat into earnings growth um so what else we're we looking at well uh euro was weaker this morning back up a bit now in the last couple of hours been a bit firmer uh, but you can just see a steady runoff for the euro uh, since last week, uh, since Friday. Um, really weak euro positioning there. Um, just recovered above this level here. So that's a positive in the near term. But um, And you can see the MACD on the hourly is looking pretty good. Um, on the daily, though, still pretty weak and potential bearish MACD set up there on that daily chart. Um, ATR showing... Um, the market is in a pretty sideways pattern right now. Um, commodities, well, we've got oil breaking out from uh, the recent range, the August range um, on Brent and WTI. So high since August the 2nd um, and doing much better on tighter US supplies. I mean, that's it for now. Thanks for watching.